Breaking news. INEC makes you turn. Sticks on the election date as Biafra Independent draws closer. Here are the news in details. Wonderful people of Biafra, lovers of freedom all over the world, you are welcome to Biafra Unite channel slash television this very moment. Today's date is 11th January 2023 and of course I have come with another breaking and interesting news for every one of you listening to my voice from your location all over the world. The Independent National Electoral Commission INEC, has made a U-turn after issuing a threat yesterday, 10th January 2023, that election could be postponed or cancelled if what is happening continues. And what is that thing happening? Because the Biafran people, 70 million Biafran people have said that there will be no election in Biafra land come 2023 apart from referendum if there should be any. Now, because of that stance of no election from Biafran people, the INEC said yesterday that election could be postponed or cancelled. But because of the activities of Biafran people, because we busted them and we exposed them and almost all the news, including the response from Mazi Simon Ekpa, went viral all over the world today, 11th January 2023, they have made a U-turn and now they want to stick on that very date for election. And that is the biggest and the best news for Biafran people and of course for the Biafra liberation. Because like as I said yesterday, on that very election and our no election stance is where we are holding the zoo in this courtroom. Because from there, it's either Biafra is declared or we will engage the zoo seriously on a very brutal guerrilla warfare. It is not hidden, we are not hiding it. It is real. It is not something we do in the hidden. It is something we do in the open. So now let me read the you know U-turn made by the INEC from Sahara Reporters, one of the zoo Gotha media outlets. According to the headline from Sahara Reporters, they said there will be no postponement of 2023 elections, says Nigerian Electoral Commission INEC. As you are seeing it on your screen right now, that is how it is from Sahara Reporters in case if you want to go and confirm for yourself. INEC National Chairman Mahmoud Yakubu, a Fulani man, said the elections will hold as scheduled, adding that no adjustment has been made to the timetable. The Independent National Electoral Commission INEC on Wednesday allayed, allayed the fears of Nigerians over the forthcoming 2023 general elections, insisting that the elections will hold as planned, which is very very good. In fact, it was I was I was even I was even shivering yesterday when they said they are going to cancel the election because I don't want them to cancel it. Some people we are jubilating, eh, they are going to cancel, uh, cancel it or postpone it. No, 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 no. This election must hold. Election must hold is a must, capital M-U-S-T. Election must hold. Because with this election and for the fact that the international community, especially the European Union, have already come to the zoo to observe the election, that is where we are going to show the world how serious we are for Biafra restoration and liberation from the zoo. So election must hold. Anybody planning to cancel the election, you are doing that at your own peril. It doesn't concern us. Election must hold next month, February 2023. Now let me continue. On Wednesday, 
Yakubu met with the leadership of the 18 political parties at the commission's headquarters in Abuja where he presented the 2023 voter regist register to the parties ahead of the elections as required by the 2022 Electoral Act. The 2023 general elections will hold as scheduled. Any report to the contrary isn't true, he said. Uh -uh. Any report to the contrary. They said they are going to, if what that is what they said yesterday, I'm not the one that said it. So what, what is he try, trying to say is not true. They said that, according to them, they said if insecurity continues, if insec ins insecurity is not checkmated, that they may postpone or cancel the election. That is what they said. So why is he denying it? Because Biafran's IPOB busted them. <laughs> because IPOB busted them. Uh, now they are panicking. They are now speaking from the both sides of their mouth. <laughs> that is what IPOB autopilot can do to you. <laughs> we, uh, I hate, I hate yellow zoo in one corner. There shall never ever be any kind of vote in Biafra land come 2023 February next month. As long as the zoo is concerned, they are now speaking from both sides of their mouth because they are panicking. They are not working. Anybody clearly see that day, zoo ye jige guangguangguo. As a kwana na maguaroge. According to the INEC chairman, he said, the voter register says there are ninety-three million four hundred and sixty-nine thousand eight registered voters for the general elections, forty-four million four hundred and fourteen thousand eight hundred and forty-six females, and the forty-nine million. 54,162 males. According to the register, there are 37,060,399 young people between the ages of 18 and 34, representing 39.65% uh, of the total registered voters, while elderly persons between the ages of 50 and 69 are 17,700,270, representing 18.94% of the total registered voters. Similarly, INEC Register Electoral Commission in charge of Kwara State Malam Atahiru Madami also said the elections will hold while speaking at the 2023 annual lecture of the National League of Veteran Journalists, NALVEG. Kwara State Council in Ilorin. He charged Nigerians to be responsible and avoid violence to ensure peaceful polls. <laughs> Let me say this. Let them ensure peaceful polls every other place. But as long as Biafra land is concerned, there will be no vote talk lens of peaceful one. Any Biafran who comes out that day, whatever you see, you take it and be, be rest assured that you will have the zoo security agents to contend with. Any Biafran in Biafra land that comes out to vote that same same day, you, you may not go back the same way you came out to tell the story. And of course, the zoo security agents will deal with you, not me. According to him, INEC has assured that election will hold despite the doubt by some Nigerians. Youth should be admonished to shun violence. Women should do that, especially mothers. We should all preach unity. Violence will take us nowhere, he said. Imagine that. <laughs> Atahiru Madami. Atahiru Madami, Malam Atahiru Madami, a Fulani man, is the one telling me, me, a Biafra man, about unity in the zoo. Can 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 someone just imagine that? After killing my brothers, <laughs> after slaughtering my brothers, you are telling me and say I'm, I mean my own brothers, you slaughter them. You come back here to tell me about unity. Are you stupid? Are you insane? 
you, you know sometimes I, I i never wanted to tell my story in this very struggle because a lot of people know my story many people know my story including the enemies know my story so i don't want to tell my story for now because my story is everywhere so after what you did to me personally more you are telling me about one nigeria and unity you are useless you are so pathetic <laughs> In fact, I'm going to go there to Salon Mozia. Pico and make it go viral. Obiadro Mumma.